You want to call it this? So it's okay, as you, as you wish, whatever is good for, for your, your product. Good morning from the Ukraine. We are in Kiev, and this is the home of the Junior Eurovision Song Contest 2013. And with us is now the young gentleman that pulled the running order number one yesterday. And this is the Swedish Antwin. It's Elias. How are you, Elias? I'm good. You? Yeah, I'm fine. Thank you very much. Uh, you went, were on the stage this morning rehearsing already. How was it for you, the first uh, rehearsal? It was uh, so fun. It was awesome. It was like such a big stage. It's so, uh, well, a couple of years ago, Eric Grapp did go to the uh, Junior Eurovision Song Contest, and he's now big in the idols in, in Sweden. Have you been able to meet Eric? Um, I, I have um, met Eric uh, ma many times, actually, because mm -hmm. we go to the same studio in Jävle. Okay. So I have met him. Oh, fantastic. And yeah. did he tell you, give you any advice how to, how to go into the Junior Eurovision Song Contest? I actually haven't met him uh, after the... Lila med Livstalen, mm -hmm. so in Sweden, the junior. So, but, so no, he ha hasn't, but. Okay, now, um, have you seen any, anything from Kiev already? Um, uh, no, not, not so much, I, a little, but um, mm -hmm. um, uh, after this, actually, we're gonna go for, from, for a walk. Okay, nice. With my crew, so it's gonna, then we're gonna, like, see. And Fantastic. Yeah. Yesterday you performed your song in the opening reception, welcome reception. Have you met anybody of the other country singers? Yeah, I have. Okay. Any friends you made already? Um, yeah, I have made little friends. Okay. You have a, you've got a favorite amongst the, the other 11 countries? Mm, not a, like a favorite. I, have, I think everyone's is very good, but I like, uh, I like uh, Russia and Ukraine. Mm -hmm. They both are very good. You're 13 years old? Yeah. yeah. And you're already a, a big musician in your country. So wh what made you become a musician? Um, uh, I, it's been all my life. Music has mm -hmm. uh, um, uh, been with me all my life. So uh, it starts when I was like three years old when I did some uh, melodies on the piano. Mm -hmm. But then it was just the piano and not singing and when I get older I s did longer melodies mm -hmm. and older and older and I start singing and it just flowed. Fantastic. Melody Festivalen is a huge music event in Sweden. Would you like to go and sing at Melody Festivalen when you're a bit older? Of course, yeah, I wouldn't say no to that. <laughs> of course. It, g it gives you a, a lot of uh, media publicity to be at the junior contest because you're part of the Eurovision history then and, and it will open up your doors as well. Yeah. Yeah. Um, have you any favorite uh, artists, uh, music you listen to normally? Um, uh, Coldplay. I Coldplay? They, mm -hmm. are, they are like the best. Okay. And in Sweden, who you think is the best Swedish uh, singer? Swedish. I like Håkan Hellström and Daniel Adams Ray. Mm -hmm. I like the and Veronica Maggio. Like wow, okay. You, you have uh, already a, a big uh, uh, big list of, of names of huge artists in your country. Yeah. That's amazing. Um, your song, tell us a bit about your song. You wrote it yourself, yeah. I understand. Yeah, I, w I have wrote it myself. And, mm -hmm. yeah. and, and what's the name and, and uh, what inspired you to write this? Uh, how did you get the idea to write that song? Um, uh, my song is called uh, The De mm -hmm. and And... Uh, my inspirations, it, it was not, I just, uh, I think I just sat in the sofa and just thought about bad things in the world and then I started writing about it. Mm -hmm. yeah. And, and uh, you, you write the song, the music and the, uh, the, the lyrics as well? Yeah, um, I have, uh, for the Lilla Melody I've mm -hmm. done the music. Okay. But then we have... The theme tune, I think, that is what you wrote. The theme tune to uh, the Lilla F F Melody Festival? Then? Yeah, actually. Wow, it's the what opening. What, what, what? The theme tune, the theme? The theme. The, the music for it? No, no, no okay. I haven't. Not the theme, but I've done my song. Oh, your song, okay, okay. Then I had a bit of wrong information, <laughs> but never, never mind, that's okay. Uh, <laughs> what's the, uh, the message in the song? What do you want to uh, tell the world? Um, uh, that the, the young people are uniting because together we can change the world. 
because together we are strong. And uh, normally there are selection uh, shows in, in the countries, but you, you were selected to go automatically to, sw to represent Sweden at the junior contest, right? Um, no. I, we, we had the uh, Lilla Melodistralen. Okay, so, so out of this uh, is the national selection. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. I didn't know uh -huh. that, but that's okay. Uh -huh. And tell us about you, your hobbies. My hobbies. Um, of course, it's singing, dancing. I, I love dancing. I, it's really a hobby for me. And uh, football, play guitar, drums, mm -hmm. Amazing. piano. And, and, you, and you have got any pets? Pets. I had fishes, but uh, we didn't feed them, so they died. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, so I hope that, that when I become a pet in my next life, and with you, are you going to feed me, hopefully? Yeah, uh, I hope that too. Okay. Elias, thank you very much for chatting with us. We wish you good luck on the stage yeah. on Saturday when you compete with the other 12 countries at the Junior Eurovision Song Contest. Mm -hmm. All the best of luck. Thanks.